How's it going, everybody? Rybread here today, and we are back with Ryan Rybread, the center for your Calgary Flames, guys. Oh my god, I was so used to playing there that I thought I had the puck as the defenseman. I'm not used to be a pro, guys. I know I just uploaded a video yesterday on him, uh, but all right, he's going to dump it in deep. I'm going to go get that. Oh, Keith Yandel around to Jokin in. But yeah, I decided since this series hasn't been around for a while, on the off day, you know, when uh, the GMO is not going to come out, we're going to do some be a pro, see if we can get to the end of the season and hopefully we can win oh my god at least make the playoffs and there we go we got in there got in deep got up the fro leak with a nice breakout pass but unfortunately we are down by two Goudreau's gonna windmill but I'm gonna find Dougie Hamilton who's gonna fire it but it goes right into Luongo's glove who makes a good save with fro leak standing right in front of him not as fast of a start as we've usually had but hey you know you can't have all awesome first shifts I believe we scored three goals and uh, out of three total uh, first shifts last game, so or last video, so that was pretty entertaining for me anyway to actually be able to score. Get it to Giordano, to Hamilton. He's going to get it to Froelich, who's going to backhand it from the corner. Don't know why he's doing that. And Goudreau's laying the body on Barkov. No way. Good Lord. All right. Chasing him down in the corner. There you go. Yager's going to get the puck back, though. But Giordano stick lifts. Good battle between him and Yager, though. Jokinen now has the puck. I'm in my little defensive area here. Ekblad over to Yandel. I still got Jokinen. And he's going to backhand it from the slot. And Elliot has to cover that up as he has a little bit of trouble fighting that one off. But thank you guys for the support on the last one. Makes me want to keep going with you guys that you guys uh, wanted to see this so badly. So let's keep it rolling, shall we? All right. He's, uh, I'm going to lose the faceoff, which we're you know kind of accustomed to at this point. He's going to windmill behind the net. Oh, my God. They're tied up. Another thing I love is when you just tie someone up randomly. Let's get it up to Goudreau. Oh, I tried to thread the needle there. I uh, tried to get a little bit too fancy, and now it's back in our end. They're going to dump it in, but there we go. I got it back, and we're getting out of the zone. Let's see. Uh, let's go uh, around the boards. There we go. And Froelich misses the puck there, and he's a but he's able to forecheck on Huberto, but unable to get the puck, and I'm going to head off the ice because I don't want to be out of here any longer. I want to get more shifts, that, which means I need to be off the ice quicker, getting more rests. Uh, guys, we are 18, 18, and or 19, 19, and 8, I believe, is our record. Uh, at the end of the video, I will update you guys on the stats and the standings. Uh, hopefully, uh, we'll have won two out of three games here. That's what my hope is to take two out of three games every uh, every video, but it hasn't quite happened. We put ourselves in a big hole to start the season, so we got to go on a run here of a couple of a couple uh, at least three points per video, uh, point per game. Still, that probably won't be enough. We need to get more than a point per game. Hope oh, Goudreau over to Froelich. He's gonna fire it. It goes wide, high and wide. And there we go. And we're going to lose the puck, and it's going to get out of the zone for them. Not what I want to happen there, go. Oh, my God. Come on, Froelich. Okay, get it up to, up to, up to me. There you go. Thank, Goudreau, are you going to pass it, or are you just going to... All right, Goudreau's going to carry it in, and then what's he going to do? Is he going to dump it around? Nope, he's going to lose the puck in the corner. Thankfully for him, I'm able to get there, but I'm not able to get the puck. But Froelich on the forecheck doing quite well. Goudreau's there. Froelich. Oh, my God, I hit, I hit Luongo anyway, so that would not have counted. Good Lord. What, uh, I can't I can't use my big body when it comes to actually hitting and interfering with the goalie. I got to use it uh, to block passes and stuff like that. Not a very good period whatsoever. But the good news for us is that we still have uh, ten minutes left in the period here. We need one goal. We need points. We need something. All right, Brody. Oh my God. Why would you circle back like that? Just fire it in deep. Just dump and chase. I know. I know the trailer said. Oh, uh, who, who, what's the what's the fun in doing all the the fundamental stuff? But you gotta just do something with the puck. Good lord, do I have to do everything? And it gets blocked by my own damn teammate. And I got hooked though. We're gonna find Brody, who's gonna fire it. And Luongo is able to. Oh my god, I actually got there. Believe it or not, it went. I did go on my stick. But oh, okay. So we're now we're on the power play thanks to a hooking penalty drawn by yours truly. You know, I'm such an all-star that I draw penalties no matter what. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. And, of course, it goes right past my skates as I step off the bench. That was the quickest change after a uh, after a simulation I've ever seen. I was not ready for that one. I was still uh, readjusting my headset here. All right, Brody, get it up to me, please. Bowmeister, thank you. All right, there we go. Bowmeister in the middle, and he's going to fire it backhand, and I just wasn't able to get there. But Brody's going to knock that down. And why would you pick that up? Oh, my God. There's no way they just they don't just pick it up. I know I know that it's hard for something to program like that, that you don't pick it up when you're offsides because who knows, do you actually want to touch it off offsides? Or... 
Oh my god, as soon as I pull it back to fire it, there's guys right there. I didn't want to go all the way back like I did. Uh, but I still was hoping to get a little bit of better of a shot off. Giordano hit me. And we'll go... And we'll lose the puck. There we go. That's We can keep doing that. Find Bomeister in the middle, and I'm going to set him up with a beautiful pass between two defensemen on the power play as we get an assist there, guys. Something we don't do often. We don't get a lot of assists. But there we go. We crawl back to within one. Very, very nice. I get the primary assist there on the power play, and we still need a goal. Six minutes left, but now it's more, it's doable. It's certainly doable, especially when Goudreau's going to forecheck, get it in deep. Pro leak to me. Oh, I didn't want to take that shot. We'll get it to the point. Giordano back to me. Oh, and I just I got it under the arm, but I wasn't able to get it past him. Let's get it back to the point. Oh, Marchesso read that pass beautifully. I, I'm on him, though. Get out of here. That's my puck. Oh, my God. No, it's not. Never mind. It's off to Riley Smith, who's going to feed it down to Marchesso or back to the point. Anyway, Yandel carries it out, and he goes off sides, and that should be it for our shift there. I noticed the red rings pop up around the bench. All right, we're going here, and how much time is left? 3.30, so we might have one more shift after this. I doubt it, so we got to make this one count, guys. This is going to be a huge shift. We can't, oh my god, we can't even break the puck out of our own freaking zone. I'm blocking shots. I'm trying to do everything. My shot blocking totals have actually climbed in the recent games. Oh my god, would you actually be able to pick up the puck? To Goudreau, oh my god, he should have waited. He could have outweighed him there and gotten around him because he Luongo was way out of the net. I definitely think Goudreau should have waited there, but that's okay. We'll get it. Ah, we'll, oh, that was a great chance, though. We, we don't always get chances like that. Medvedev over to Demers. I got to get that puck. I got to get there. Oh, shoot. And Trocek fires it wide. Oh, come on. I How come we can't pick up the puck? It just seems like we're, we just can't pick up the puck. It's impossible for us to pick up the puck. Ow. Again, another block shot. Elliot with the pass to Brody. I'm going to pick that up. I'm going to carry it out because my guys can't seem to do jack. Hup. Let's, uh, okay. Yeah, okay. In the middle, Froleek. Oh, is that going to go in? It's going to go in, and we're going to get the two assists. And wow, there's Panthers flopping all over the place. And there it is, guys. We have tied the game. That's the way you want to do it there, guys. All right, two and a half minutes left, and probably headed to, oh, 45 seconds left in the game. We're going out on the ice. I was not expecting a shift here. But I guess uh, the stars aligned and we were able to go out on the ice because there's 45 seconds left to face off and we have a decent amount of stamina left. And I lost that face off, which is a pretty big face off to lose. But I'm going to get that puck back, I promise. And all right, they're going to go off sides. I hope my shift's not over. We still got another chance at it. Let's see if I can win the face off. The problem with face offs is you keep losing them and you lose experience for it. And you, and you, it, because you, and you lose experience, so you can't win. And it's just a slippery slope there, guys. Pro leak up to me. Nice. Gets it to me. Oh, oh, here. Oh, my God. I wasn't able to get. I, oh, I, shoot. I was on a mini breakaway there. Now I got to get back and play some defense. Because next thing you know, he's going to fire it from there. And they're going to score. Ekblad's now got the puck. McKenzie from the slot. And Elliot makes a save. Give it here, Elliot. All right. Giordano up to Fro leak. Fro leak up to Goudreau. Goudreau's going to toe drag. He gets to the middle. Why is that a bad call on for pass by me? Oh, and it goes just wide to the top corner. And look at that, guys. We are headed to overtime. Beautiful. So there we go, guys. We are headed to overtime. And here we go, guys. The overtime period is about to start. Let's see if we can get off to a quick start here and end this game early and hopefully not go into a shootout because uh, we know what happened last time when we went into a shootout. Although we did win, our goalie's jockstrap ended up next to the banners up in the rafter. And he's going to dump it down deep. I'm okay with that. Oh, and I was just un unable to lift Ekblad's stick. I'm going to kind of glide back. I'm not going to use too much energy because they don't have anybody on the offensive attack. Barkov now has the puck. Gets it back to Ekblad. Up to Barkov, back to Ekblad. I poke it, though. I block the pass. And then Hamilton with a huge hit. And we're going to go between the legs. Oh, my God. I tried to shoot it, but he uh, Luongo's able to poke it before I could get the shot off. All right, uh, let's see. The defenseman peel off there. Interesting. Nice. Giordano with the puck. Oh, my God. And they almost put it into our own net. Oh, my freaking God. My teammates don't want to be in overtime. Oh, get, get back to the point. Nice. Back to me. All right, I'll take it. Oh, shoot. He's going to body me. Oh, but I'm able to keep that in. That could turn out to be a big uh, – never mind. Ne nope, nope, nothing. I was going to say, it might turn out to be a big deal that I kept that puck in, but I got, I got, I got knocked off the puck. No big deal. 
Uh, <laughs> come on, simulate. There we go. Four minutes left in the overtime period. A minute gone. Two minutes left. So we're only off for a minute there. We're, and we're headed back out in the overtime period. Dougie Hamilton has the puck. And we, yes, they got it up to me. Oh, I don't have the acceleration to quite beat Ekblad. Ekblad got back quickly. He saw that stretch pass, and he was ready to get back. I got that plus 10 for the poke check. Oh, my God. And Oh, my God. Whoa. Oh, my God. 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 Jesus. I was really worried <laughs> that they were going to score. They, you see how close that was? Somehow, Elliot is able to use his magic powers to keep the puck out of the net. Here we go. And even though I lost the faceoff, I come up out with the puck. Oh, my God. Nope. Aha, suck it. I pull. Oh, the puck just didn't. It didn't go loose off a stick. I wasn't able to pick it up after I knocked it slightly loose. There we go. Yes. Yes, come on. All right, that's stick checking, though. I'm getting really good at stick checking. It's probably my best attribute. There we go. Yep, see, look, guys. I'm going nuts with these poke checks and stick lifts. Oh, I got to get there. Oh, I just not wasn't able to get there. Oh, my God, now I'm out of the zone. It's a three-on-two in the zone. He's going to walk to the slot. Nice, Brody gets it up to me. Oh, and their defenseman steps up. I don't know why he does that. Oh, my God, I'm getting nudged off the puck. All over the place. I can't freaking hang on to the puck. All right, I'm staying on the ice. Come on. No, no. I got, the, I got it on lock. I got my defensive end on lock. Never mind, I got stuck behind the net. But Elliot actually bails me out for once. Good Lord. Oh, and Elliot with another save. All right, all right. He's not going to listen to me. I got a minute and 20 shift. That's fine. He's made 34 saves on 36 shots tonight. And there it is, guys. We are headed to a shootout in the first game of this one, guys. Let's see if we can take all two points. I know we've already got a point here, but let's see if we can double what we're going to take out of this and take two. Barkov comes up first. Backhand toe drag and fires it right into the stick of Brian Elliott. Now, first up should be Goudreau. Yep, it is Goudreau. He's coming in slot, shoots it. Oh, tried to go five hole. Or either he went fi tried to go five hole here or tried to go just beneath the blocker, but couldn't get either one to go. Huberto coming in wide, goes backhand, tries to flick it with the backhand and hits the bottom of Elliott's glove, but he's able to keep the puck out of the net there. And then now I'm up, guys. Let's see what we can. Can we get some uh, a little a goal? Oh, and he poke checks me that. Oh, I hate when the goalie poke checks you. Because right here, I got him. I got that toe drag right around him, but I'm not able to get it. Ah, oh, he poke checks me. Now they could get, put the serious pressure on, but no, he's going to lose the puck. Bumped into Elliott. No, he's unable to keep the puck on his stick. Now, TJ Brody, I always laugh when they send the defenseman out. And he's going to do lots of moves, cut back, and he's unable. To, he, this is his move, guys. He loves to go that low blocker side, but it's unable to work. The living legend, Yager, but what a save by Elliott as he tried to roof it on him. Look at this. Little toe drag, bang. Wow. All right, now Dougie Hamilton, another defender, coming in, kicks it. Oh, man. Does the fake shot and is unable to actually get a shot off, I think. Or actually, he did. He tried to slide it underneath the pad. That's not going to work. So Thomas Vanek comes up now. Vanek with the master in the shootout. I was just about to say he's a, ma he's a shootout master. And look at that, guys. The jock straps are collecting up there in the rafters. And we might have more jock straps up there than banners. Elliot, you're going to need to go buy another one, my friend. All right, for Christopher Stieg with our only hope to get two points. Oh, and he's not able to put it above him. He just loses the puck, guys, and that's it for this one. All right, guys, good news and bad news. Bad news, we're not winning. Good news, we're not losing. It's 1-1 against a stingy defensive team in the Nashville Predators. Let's see if we can take a win. We're in a good position here. Get it over to Goudreau. He's going to fire it. What a pass, guys. My passing has seriously improved. Wow. All right, wow, quickly too, seven seconds in Goudreau. We're a master getting Goudreau that under 10 second goal there, and I'm winning face-offs, that's huge. That is the Nashville Predators' weakness, is their center core, and wow, I just got my, yeah, no, I totally got poked off there. I'm gonna get back, oh, he's almost got the poke in, oh wow, Elliot, come on, let's let's not, oh my god, what the hell are you doing? Are you shooting on our own net? You freaking, oh my god, idiot. Oh, go for a leak. You got him beat. Don't slap it. Oh, it's going to work. Oh, and he's unable to get it around Pekka Rene, I believe that is. So Rene, their number one, is in net. He finds Ellis. The defense is jumping up. We gotta be. I got to be ready for that as the center. I got to watch for these guys coming down the middle of the slot. All right, I got Johansson around the net. All right, that's fine. Ellis. Oh, and Froelich is able to get the puck. Let's go. I'm with you. He's going to, oh, find me, I guess. 
I'm gonna shoot it. All right, all right. I just felt like shooting it. Oh, rip it. Show, show them why our defensive core is good too. Hamilton, to me, back to Hamilton. He's gonna shoot it for Leak. To me, oh my God. Come on, I got the puck though. Get there, get there. Oh, oh, uh, that is uh, Bowman or Brower, excuse me. Over here, back door to Froelich. Oh, he's just not able to put it above the pad of Rene, and I believe he just hits the side of the net. But what an offensive first shift against the Predators! A very, very good defensive team, and we are able to control the offensive end of the ice. That's going to be key, guys. We cannot let their defense uh, obliterate our offensive game. Because then once their defense can stop our offense, their defense can turn into offense and, be, and become more offensive players if our offense doesn't, uh, doesn't uh, actually pose a threat. Bartkowski has the puck now. We're all crowding the center of the ice. Bartkowski won't get out of my freaking way. Goudreau, what's he going to do with it? He's going to put around the... Oh, no, he's going to go to the middle of the ice. All right, that's fine. All right, we'll get it back to the point there. Back to me. Oh, shoot. And I got stuck in an animation and wasn't able to pick the puck up. Although it would have been a good animation if I did pick the puck up. And Forsberg tries to get fancy with it, but I shut that down. No way, not in my house. Back to the point. Weidman back to me. Barkowski, oh, on the glove side of Rene. And he's not able to put that one home. But, man, what a shot. That would that one looked like it had a potential of going in. <clears throat> two, min two, uh, two minutes tick off the clock is... We are out shooting the Predators by 10 now. So our offense is certainly can't come to play. To the middle to Goudreau. Oh my god, guys. I am figuring out how to become a playmaker as a center. One timer for Leak hits for Leak and Goudreau gets the puck. Oh my god, that one timer was beautiful from me. But it just ran into our it hit not ran into it. Hit our own teammate. Smith with the slapper. Elliott makes the glove save. And he's gonna hold on to it even though I wanted it. That means we're going to get an offense or a defensive zone faceoff, excuse me. And we know how faceoffs go. And our guy doesn't even come in, in to help pick up the puck. And Froelich gets the puck. He's going to carry it out. Give it to me. There we go. All right, I'm around. Back door. Oh, and he just is. Oh, what a good tap, though. Uh, oh, my God. I tried passing just as, as he hit me. I, I hit the pass button. Tried to hit Goudreau in the slot there. He had a little bit of space. I was hoping he would get some... Uh, Get some, uh, get a shot off, but he's unable to do so. <clears throat> we still have the one goal lead, though. Hopefully, I didn't jinx us. I did not jinx us. Nine minutes left in the period. Come on, guys. We got, all right, coach wants me to play solid defense. I'll do it for you, coach. I right, Giordano, back to him. Oh, bad call for pass. Forsberg, though. I'm gonna forecheck on Forsberg. Goudreau. Oh, I, I was kind of hoping he would slide it to me there. That would be a really quick and a really smart pass. So I wouldn't expect the AI to have a smart pass like that. Oh, but Hamilton. Get it up quickly. There you go. Up quickly, the better. Uh, why do we have somebody... Why is... All right, Froelich, what the hell are you doing up here? Are you being tied up? That's what I want to figure out. Oh, my God. This is what I'm talking about, guys. This right here is exactly what I'm talking about. This BS. They're stuck in a net front battle. And f what? Like, Froelich could easily break out of that and skate forward. And Nashville's got the puck. Why is Yossi net battling with Fro... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me right now? Oh, come on, EA. I expect better than that. I love you guys, but you guys got to do better than that. Come on. All right, so now we're back into action. Craig Smith, after viewing the videotape... And that's actually... Jesus, videotape isn't... Like, nobody even uses that anymore. Like, a VCR? How many of you actually have used a VCR? Let, let me know in the comment section if you've used a VCR before, because I actually want to know. Uh, how many of you have and how many of you haven't? I guess I could just look at my demographics uh, on the YouTube analytics and be able to figure that one out. But, uh, all right, Froelich now has the puck. I'm with you, Froelich. He's going to find me. Go to the net, Froelich. Shoot it low. All right, Yossi, but oh, I knocked the puck off. But, and now let's get it out to Smith, and we're going to go up the ice. But, yeah, I guess I could use the YouTube analytics and check out my demographics to see just how many of you have probably used a VCR before. But I want to know. So if you've used a VCR, go ahead and let me know down in the comments section. I know it's a little bit of a weird thing to be thinking about during a beer pro series, but hey, you know, it happens. But in solid defense, though, with five minutes left, are we going to be able to hold it? Wilson, I got that body check on him. He's not getting anywhere. All right, back check. I got a defensive awareness boost for back checking. Okay, I like that. And he's going to go to the point. I figured Arvid's into the slot, and it's blocked. I'm going to pick it up, though. We're going to feed it up to Goudreau, but I, Goudreau's not able to slide over just so slightly. It was... Apparently, it was inconvenient for him to slide over there. 
Yossi to Ellis. I'm trying to stop the point because that's a big spot where you got to stop the Nashville Predators. And Goudreau is going to carry it up. There's no space in the middle of the ice. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to pick it up, but Yossi, I guess, is the one who was able to pick that up. Is he going to, if he cuts to the middle, I got him. Oh my God, too many pokes. I know I only poked once, but it was just one too many times. Goudreau runs into me. He's not going to feed it up to me either. Oh my God, now I got to come back into the defensive end. And Johansson with the slapper, because Goudreau's a freaking idiot. We can't get the puck out. He's not even going to shovel it out of the zone. He's going to hold on to it, lose the puck. It slides over to Johansson, who beats Elliott with a clean slapper from the top of the circle uh, to, to Elliott's left. Come on. you gotta. That's the save I want you to have as a goalie. There we go. Run a little interference because EA Sports doesn't call penalties. Interference penalties don't exist anymore, I guess. Yossi windmills behind the net. That's fine with me. Goudreau finally figures out how to get it up. There we go. Snipe it. Oh, man. All right, so apparently I aimed the shot poorly. I didn't feel like I aimed it poorly. I feel like that's the spot to aim for. But apparently I did. And, ooh, good good nudge on Yossi there. Yossi's playing forward. Oh, wow. He, wow, that was a quick pass. Goudreau fires it to me. Oh, I do a little sidestep. Oh, I tried to windmill. Oh, I thought I was going to be able to windmill around the defender there. Now I got to get back. No time for a line change, coach. I got to get back and play some defense. I know I know, I know, know you know I'm tired, but Weidman, get it up to me. We'll get it over to Froelich. Breakout pass, beautiful. Over to me. Oh, I'm wide. I'm all alone. Oh, and I just couldn't get the shot off. Oh, but he, oh, come on. Pick up the puck. There we go. Um, Let's go. In the middle. Oh, Froelich, I got to get there. Irwin's going to come up with the puck. Yo feeds it to Yossi. 11 seconds left. I got to hustle. I know I'm exhausted, but there we go. Get Go. Go, Versteeg. Four seconds. Shoot it. Oh, and on Rene. And, oh, man. And that's it, guys. Another overtime game. We This time we blew away the lead instead of tying it up. So let's go ahead and get to puck drop in the overtime period. Can we beat Johansson on the faceoff? Overtime faceoffs are always huge because they set you up great. Well, Hamilton's in deep, though. But all their defenders are deep, too. So they got nobody breaking out. Yossi, I'm going to forecheck. Good check on Yossi as I knock him out of the play, but now he's in front of me. i got to get back. All right. Oh, and he's in. Oh, and he gets the slap shot off. That's bad by me. Thank God Elliot bailed me out there. Subban got the puck. Hamilton, Johansson steps up. I'm going to pick up that puck uh, instead of Johansson. Let's drop it back to Dougie Hamilton, who's going to fire it way wide. And I'm trying to get in out there on that forecheck. Now I got to get back to the defense. I really got to worry about the defense in uh, three on three. Ooh. And they, oh, yes, but I'm able to keep Yossi away from that puck just enough. He's going to turn. I'm going to give him a nudge. I knocked the puck off a stick, but I'm unable to get it. So, you know what? Uh, let me interfere with him on my way to the bench because, you know, like I said, interference penalties don't actually matter. So might as well interfere whenever. As long as you don't hit the right stick, it's not an interference. And that's in the NHL rule book, guys. All right, two minutes left in the period. In the overtime period, can we avoid a uh, shootout, please? Ekholm. Boom. All right, Ekholm's pretty big, though, guys. I'm not going to knock him down unless I was really trying to get on my horse and really hit him. He finds Ellis. Oh, and wow, Ellis with the individual effort after a great pass. And we lose our second overtime game in a row. So we got two points in the last two games. I'm okay. Let's see if we can make it four points. Four points in three games, I'm a little bit more okay with. Let's take the next game in the Battle of Alberta. All right, guys, here we go. Time for the Battle of Alberta. In the third period, we are up 3-0, and I decided to put on the good jerseys, guys. These are the good luck jerseys, I guess. Uh, we're doing pretty well. All right, Sakara, turn around. I dare you. All right. So uh, if the audio changed, uh, I apologize. Uh, because I didn't have my settings quite right. It was still on a diff on the internal microphone when it should have been on the microphone that I use. So I apologize if this is a sounds a little bit different and it's a weird jump. And I'm able to block that pass, though. Goudreau now has the puck. Feed me. There we go. I'm around Sakara. Oh, let's... Oh, 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 my God. And they got Gustafson in that. So it's not Talbot. Tap Talbot? Yeah, Cam Talbot. Connor McDavid leads his team in points with 52, 19 goals, 33 assists. Man, the guy is good. I think I should have done a, a, been a sniper with how I play just because that would have helped me out because I score a lot. I don't necessarily pass a lot, but in this video, I've really figured out how to become more of a playmaker. 
Giordano finds Fro uh, uh, Froleek, and we get out of the zone. Find me. McDavid's fast. Not fast enough, though. Finds the point. Oh, he's going to one-time it. Okay. Get down there, Goudreau. Yes. All right. Russell's got the puck. I knock it off. Versteeg has the puck. He's going to hit the point, man. Oh, and I'm going to shoot that. I wasn't even expecting to shoot that. Goudreau now has the puck. Oh, I got the deflection in, and I'm unable to get a good offensive sequence here. Oh, and I tried to one-time that, but it's not going to go. But Russell, oh, I knocked the puck off his stick, and there we go, guys. It does look like uh, this period <clears throat> going our way. This game is going our way so far, guys. Oh, all right. So let's see how much time is left. Oh, coach is putting, out, pu putting us out there a little bit more tired than usual. 16, 18 left in the period. Here we go. All right. Around the boards, he goes to pull Yarvi. Goudreau knocks it off his stick and then fires it. A good shot right off the bat. Hamilton dumps it down deep, which is a great smart play. I'm down there on Russell. He's going to kick it over to Froleek. Froleek finds me. All right, I'm going to hit the point man, Hamilton. I'm going to set the pick. He's going to find me, and I'm going to shoot at Goudreau, and he's able to wrap it around the goalie there, and that's Goudreau's second of the night, guys. That could be our second assist, but that's our first assist of this period after the shot. I was shooting to score. It landed right on Goudreau's stick, and we were able to net our fourth of the game, guys. All right, so here we go. Hamilton over to Goudreau. Goudreau, what are you going to do with it? Get it around deep, please. No. All right. He's going to try and find the slot guy. Giordano with the shot. Oh, my God. Wow. That was a cannon. Oh, and I poke it. Nick. Oh, Goudreau feeds it through the five hole. It just misses the net. And Russell finds Sakara, and they might break it out for once. Our four check has been great. Part of the reason we're doing so well is our four check. No, you're not going to pass to me. That's cool. Dang it. Oh, I was really hoping I would get that. But as long as it wasn't a minus for... Uh, Bad call for pass. I'm okay with it. And, he, and uh, Elliot leaves it there and then gets hit. Gets hit behind the net. Really? Is that how we're going to play now, Edmonton? You want me to hurt your goalie? I'll certainly take runs at your goalie if you're going to take a run at my goalie. As much as I hate my goalie, I will stick up for him nine times out of ten. Uh, unless he deserves it, of course. But, oh, God. If they're going to hit Elliot behind the net, I am no holds barred on uh, – on uh, uh, Gustafson in net. Oh, I'm, I'm throwing my body around. It's 4-0. I, I could care less about points at this point. You know, uh, individual points. I'm not talking team points. All right, let's get it up. Over to Froleek. Come on, Froleek. Get there. And, yeah, he finds me. I was sorry I was quiet there, guys. I was focusing. But we're able to slap that home and screw you, Edmonton. Oh, this is becoming a heated rivalry, guys. Whew. And there we go. That's our 24th of the season as we fire this one home. A slick pass from Froleek and bang, fires it right past Talbot. Oh, they pulled Gustafson and actually put in Talbot. You see I peel off there, stop right behind Russell, and I'm able to sheathe the sword and keep the stick hot. Let's keep it going, guys. We've been hot these past couple games, getting lots of points. Can we keep it up? Oh, I lost the face off there. That's fine. Let's keep him out of the zone. There we go, McDavid's... Oh, okay, so he's going to dump it in deep. But if we can get there, that's great. All right, Giordano, nice. All right, Giordano finds Goudreau. Goudreau gets absolutely leveled, and there we go. We're sticking up. McDavid's in a fight with Giordano. McDavid, oh, my God, Giordano, you better kick the crap out of McDavid. Send a statement. One of the league's best, and we're going to kick the absolute... Oh, kick him to the... Mm. Oh, I can't even say what I want to say. But we're just going to absolutely wreck him. Come on, Giordano. Take him out of the game for five minutes. There you go. Oh, knock his block loose. End his career. Give him a concussion. Crosby him. Oh, God. And Giordano with one quick little jab is able to knock down the little wimp that is McDavid. And Giordano calmly raises both arms as he knows he just defeated a lesser opponent, so there's no reason to brag. And But, wow, that hit by McDavid on another superstar like Goudreau. That is just not seen, and he's a minus three, so his team's probably better that he got a penalty anyway. He's a minus three. He's been terrible this game. Hamilton finding Goudreau, finding me, and I'm able to wrap it around, and we get another goal, guys. That's three points this period. Two goals and an assist, and who knows? I might have had an assist on Goudreau's goal earlier. I would love to see us keep scoring. That's our 25th of the season, our second tonight. Let's go. Oh, my goodness.
Let's keep it rolling, guys. We are destroying the Edmonton Oilers in this final game. Looks like we are going to get four points out of a possible six, so I will take it. Goudreau fires a slap shot. I mean, when you're this hot, why not, right? And he's able to board play me. I'm, all right, let's see if I can get it around to Froelich. Oh, he's going to try. All right, Froelich finds Goudreau, who tries to pick it up and fire it, but he just could not. But Goudreau on that four check. All right, I'm able to knock it off Nugent Hopkins' stick. All right, now it's time to get off the ice because I was close enough anyway. I wasn't really going to do anything. But there we go, guys. It's 6 nothing. Your Calgary Flames are absolutely annihilating the Edmonton Oilers. All right, it's 7.20 left, so Coach is giving me a lot of shifts, and he's, but he's telling me to keep it clean. Maybe he wants me to get that hat trick. Let's see if we can get that hat trick, guys. Let's do it. All right, they're going to, okay. Oh, and they go off sides. That's fine. I don't know if I've scored a hat trick yet, though. I'm actually, I'm, I'm chasing that hat trick, and I'm chasing multi-points. I'm chasing higher, oh, higher skill. Sweet. I don't see that very often. All right, let's get it back to the point. Hamilton to Froelich. Oh, and he's just not able to put that in. And I'm going to chop that in the net because, you know, why not? Why not be a, why not be a, a jerk after the whistle? All right, let's go ahead and win this face-off back. Oh, God. But we're able to get in there on, on Russell. I lose the puck, though, because I didn't think I was going to get the puck. It's a, my camera angle is a little bit tough for that. Let's focus on me, though. Oh, wow, what a hit. And Dreisaitl with the puck. All right, Cassie, and that's my puck. Get out of here. I'm going to stick lift him twice. He's going to check me and knock me off the puck somehow. Russell's got the puck. He's going to fire it over to Sakara, who finds Cassian. Dreisaitl now to Russell, back to Cassian. Oh, down to Dreisaitl, who's going to try and windmill. Gets around both of us. And the effort there, even being up 6-0, going down to block the shot. I love That's what you love to see when you're a teammate. Called my team out, teammates out a while ago for not having any heart. And I got, uh, wow, I made Elliot have to make a save there. Bad pass by me. I thought there was going to be a defenseman there at the point. But, you know, line changes and stuff like that. Exhaustion, you know, fatigue, you know, the casual stuff. Six minutes left. Simulating. Let's see how long there's going to be left. 3.38, and we are on the power play, guys. Let's see if we can get our hat trick on the power play. Versteeg gets it in deep. I'm going to go chase after it to reward him. Wisniewski finds Nurse right away. He didn't even take any time to get that one off. And they're going to go for it on the power play shorthand, or on the shorthanded when we're on the power play. Weidman, Weidman, come on, do something with it. Find me, thank you. Let's spin. Oh, man, and he knocks me off the puck. But I'm able to block the pass. And I'm going to keep poke checking, guys. If it's going to work, I'm going to keep poke checking. There we go. I steal the puck. Versteeg now has the puck to Brower. Oh, he should have found me. He finds Wisniewski there, uh, Talbot does, finds Nurse. They're going to get it out of the zone. Step up by Brower, over to Versteeg. Up to me, but I'm unable. I, bad call for pass. Coach isn't liking that because it's all about the team play now. We're up 6-0. We can't get too cocky or embarrass them too much, but let's step off the ice with 244 left. Who knows if we'll get another shift, but let's keep it going. 239 simulating. Are we getting another shift? 223. We're coming right back out, guys. No time wasted from Coach. I'm a little bit tired. This should be the last shift. Connor McDavid is back out on the ice. Let's see if we can beat him up a little bit more. Insult injury. There we go. Oh, and we did win that faceoff. And I don't know. Oh, my controller just died in my hands. One second, guys. There we go, guys. I have now <laughs> plugged in my controller, so now it's charging. Let's get it up, Hamilton. There you go. Froelich, over to me. Nice. I'm going to cut. Oh, back door. Oh, and he's not able to. I can't. I just couldn't quite get it all the way to him. And I could have had two assists, two goals. That would have been fantastic. All right, let's see if we can win this face off, though. Keep it rolling. There we go. We do to Hamilton, who finds Froelich, but he's not able to get the shot off. But then he is. Uh, a little bit later, he's not a really good shot off, but uh, 
Pro leak. Find me, baby. Oh, he's going to take the shot himself. I probably should have called for it. And that is the, uh, that's probably our last part. That's our last shift, guys. Two minutes left in the period. We have just annihilated the Edmonton Oilers in the Battle of Alberta, six to nothing. So there we go, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm having a lot of fun with the Be A Pro again. Glad you guys are in, uh, enjoying it, and uh, I'm happy I brought it back. So make sure to subscribe if you want to see some more content. Uh, and remember, we're on the road to 500. So at 500 subscribers, I will start doing a face cam on live streams and on actual videos so you guys can actually see my reaction and know what I look like. So there we go, guys. That's it. Thanks, thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Wait a minute. I told you guys I was going to show you the stats and the standings. So I, I started my outro prematurely, so I apologize for that. So you guys can see here who we've got up next. In the next video should be the Leafs, Canadians, and Senators. So three more Canadian teams we have to face. Um, and then here are the points. My, well, my personal points. So let's go ahead and check those out. I believe we've gotten closer to point per game. And we should be closer to the top of the league here. Let's see here. We got 46 points in 49 games. We are flying off. Like, this is a great rookie season. We're still still listed as a medium AHL bottom six potential forward. But 46 points in 49 games, I think you're a little bit better than AHL bottom six. We're plus nine, so we're not a minus. But Goudreau and Frolik are certainly better pluses when, uh, than we are. And I, we, I've got 30 penalty minutes. You know, I, take, I do take some penalties. Uh, but let's go ahead and check out how we are in the entire league. Probably leading rookies, I'd hope. Patrick Kane is on a tear. 37 goals in 48 games. He's got 55 points. McDavid has 52 points in 47 games. We are up there, though, guys. We are close. We're only nine points behind him. That's ridiculous. And then as far as goals are concerned, we are third in the league in goals. Above guys like Stamkos, Goudreau has worked his way up there. I'm glad I've got 20 in each, and this is a really good rookie season for me. I'm really, really happy with it. But Kane and Ovechkin, both slightly higher than I am. Kane, i got to catch him in goals. i got to get 12 more goals by the end of the season. That might not happen. But as far as points, he's got the most points just because he's getting so many goals. Uh, i got to catch him. That's 9 points and 12 goals that I have to catch up to him in. But there we go, guys. That is my personal stats. Let's go ahead and check out the team standings and how far out of the playoffs we are. So we have 51. We have 50 points, and third place has 51. So we're really not that far out of it. Check out the Central Division. Yeah, so they got they got the top two wild card spots, but looks like we can still catch the uh, both the Edmonton Oilers and the San Jose Sharks. Kings are a little bit too far away for us to catch them. But we if we go if we get hot here, we can certainly catch the Sharks and the Oilers. Uh, so there it is, guys. Again, like I was saying uh, before. I am on the road to 500 subscribers, which when we get to 500, I will start doing a face cam. So if you want to see me do a face cam, go ahead and subscribe and spread the word um, so you guys can see my reaction. And, you know, I do a lot of stuff with my hands and with my face when I'm playing, and you guys don't get to see that. So I was thinking if, if, if we do get to 500, I'm, I'm feeling more like an actual channel than at 500, like it has the potential to be big, and that it would be okay to show you guys what I look like. So make sure to subscribe if you want to see that, and I will see you guys in the next one.